Good afternoon everybody, it's Denise here, Denise Junk Journals UK. Thank you so much for joining me, it is lovely to have you here. Now it is Thursday so that means it's time for um, Tanya at Dirty Treasure and Nanina Collage type collaboration which is the Gentleman Kit um, and the one um, mainly that I have been using, the one that these papers and, and bits are from but some of them are from another kit. The main one I'm using is the one that's in Nanine's shop at the moment so it's like a new add-on kit that goes with all the other bits. Um, I am in the middle of the journal which is, no I'm not in the middle of it, I've nearly finished it um, here uh, but I'm not working on it at the moment. I'm going to do some um, ephemera today um, just because yeah, I, I haven't been able to get into my room. I've just squeezed in now for half an hour and then, <laughs> then I've got to pack everything up and go again. So I haven't been able to, um, you know, work on what I'm going to do. It needs a, a closure, I think, and a few things like that. But um, rather than sit and wait and, you know, sort oops, losing my papers. I should be over here. Um, yeah, and work out what I'm going to do with it. I just thought I would, because there's so much of the uh, ephemera and um, embellishments, not ephemera, so much ephemera, um, in this little thing here and I've got some envelopes and such like I think they're all envelopes actually envelopes and bags that I want to decorate up with this um, with these embellishments that I thought that would be a good thing to just come on and do so let's let's do that let's have just a bit of fun embellishing so this is a um, envelope <laughs> that you got there before me didn't you this is an envelope from the kit that's the only piece from the kit I think that I'm embellishing these are two lovely dark green um textured envelopes um from tanya who i believe i think she's still got them in a shop i'm not sure but she's had them in a shop and in various colors blue and gray um a couple of glassine bags um a lovely black envelope which goes really well with this stuff and a very um thin flimsy craft coloured envelope so yes yeah, let's let's just embellish them now embellishing them is going to be reasonably easy I've got lots of um, spare bits of paper here and then all these lovely um, pieces of embellishment so you know I could just literally have a look at it with my eyes closed and, and stick them on and they'd be fine but let's start with this little black one then because this is going to be really striking isn't it and I think what I'll probably do because I've got so much going on there is them just lay a few few bits out and see what what catches my eye initially i've got a pocket in there look that shouldn't be in there should it so i've got all these lovely strips now i have finally got a plastic box um one of those they're called really useful boxes with them um, uh the, the plastic square can i reach it yeah one of these look to go in the top of it for this kit all i've got to do is organize everything into it <laughs> and then um yeah it'll be easier to see exactly what i've got i love that check i'm just having just reminding myself because i haven't had this stuff out for ages and i am fancying something like this on it because it's just going to be gorgeous but i want it tall ways tall ways does that make sense oh Oh, look at that. That's gorgeous. That's the fountain pen one as well. So, um, yeah, a label on it would be nice. Right, where does it fall? fold over? There. So, yeah, I think I'll have it as a pocket um, filler. So I'll have something on the outside like that. Yeah, down at the bottom with something at the top. And, um, yeah, and then something inside it as well. You'll see what I mean about it being so easy. I mean, you could really go to town decorating. Um, but if you want to do something in a hurry like I'm doing today or, you know, you find it hard to put things together. This is a good kit because, you know, the work's all done for you. And anything I, I picked out of here to put on this lovely black envelope would, would go fine, I'm sure. Oops, fallen over. I was going at the bottom, wasn't it? Yeah, I just think a label at the top would be nice. Simple but beautiful. <laughs> I'm not going to say like me. <laughs> not that I wouldn't call myself simple, but I don't think I'd call myself beautiful either. Although, you know, we're all beautiful in our own way, aren't we? We won't go down that road. Um, don't try have a look in here with me then. So we've got these lovely bits. 
King's Lane. I'm thinking I want an actual label though. Um, not black because it is black. Oh, that might be. I know it's a different kind of, different coloured tan, if you like. Brown, beige. I just like the idea that it could be, the fountain pen could be the thing that's the order. And then the receipt or the paperwork to go with it could be in there. So I'm going to go off to the side with it. Oops, oops. <laughs> I dropped it twice and saved it. Like side and the top there. And then I'm just wondering about one of these. Little circular. Or maybe one of these. Queen's Crossing. No. Too much to choose from. This is the thing, isn't it? You probably can't see anything either. I don't know why I was just fancying a little round. Maybe we'll put one on the back here. A, a label, I meant not a little round. Look, there's a little teeny tiny ticket now. Okay, keep going. Keep digging, there's something. Oh, that's nice. Typewriter, no. Typewriter and pen. Not really. That might be a nice ticket to put in there. It is, look. Um, well, maybe something like that on the back then. That can be written on as well, can't it? Okay, let's cut this out because I like this ticket for inside. Oops. Nice when you open envelopes and you find interesting things in them. For... You know, just for the fun of finding them and if you want to to journal or, you know, keep secrets or something like that. Right, you can have a bit of brown. I think this one I'm going to stick on the outside needs a bit of black ink on it. Yeah, I'm thinking that might be nice with a piece of, just a piece of paper in it as well. Let's get the ruler. Just like that. Yeah. Lovely. You could put no end of things in there, couldn't you? But I do like that. Let's uh, let's get some black ink just to disguise where I've not quite cut all the, the edge off. Um, yeah, that way. That can be written on then, can't it? Might have something above there as well. Let's see. Me, um, the glue's nearly empty and I keep leaving the lid off it. So this is my second video today. And I'm not videoing in any kind of order. And I'm videoing kind of quick <laughs> to get them done because, um, yeah, the boiler took longer. Well, not the boiler, because they haven't actually started that yet. But the work they were doing, getting ready for the boiler, took a day longer than expected. So I, uh, I've been out of my room so far a day longer than I thought I would be. Um, I knew it didn't matter too much. I knew I'd get in eventually and, and do a couple of videos. But it will be nice when we get back to... No, I did like that name. Do we want his name on it? Maybe not. What did we get on the front? Just an order number. Um, on date received. Oh, I might have that in the bottom of there. Look, I like that. What was I saying? I've, I've forgotten. <laughs> oh, yeah. So, yeah. I'm, uh, I'm enjoying what I'm doing, but I'll be pleased when I can get in and... Well, get it tidied up because obviously everything's everything's piled up out of their way. <laughs> get it tidied up and then get working in it. Okay, love that. Don't don't lose it. Next was do a glassy one next. Where's the little teeny tiny one? Oh dear. Got lost in all that. Yeah. Oh well, it'll come back to us. 
Right. Um, I like things on the back of these that you can see through. That's all kind of sideways on, aren't they? I do like this piece. So put it on the inside, look it through. It shows through lovely. Let's, uh, I've got lines to follow, so I'll trim it down there. So this is a page from the kit that I've printed smaller. And it's on... On 160 card, maybe something like that. So, if it's going inside, I want it on that one there. Some lovely cut off pieces to play with, and some lovely clusters at the end, I think. Yep, yeah. and then there. Oh, it's so nice when you've got a grid to follow, lines going both ways, no measuring. Let's see how well we did it now. Um, I suppose we ought to go that way. That bit at the front. The bag's got a bit creased. And see, what I'm thinking is actually sticking that in and making it the back of the... Let's see if I can do that. The back of the pocket. It'll be a pocket shouldn't need a lot, it's just kind of get it down before it grabs. Let's see. I'm going to have to pull it a bit, I think. No. Yeah, so my idea is that will be stuck down. That is the back of the pocket. The tag can go in there. Right, I can maybe have one of these strips up here, look. English way. ID number. Hmm, I'm thinking maybe a measure. Oh, they're not big enough. Hmm, nope. It's not appealing to me. Let's have a look. I've got don't recall seeing that. <laughs> don't know if that's from this kit or not. It may well be, but well that's nice. Tag shaped. I want something black, don't I? No. No. Just keep trying things until I, you know I find some. Oh, a typewriter! I've just remembered. Wasn't there some lovely typewriters? Typewriter would be nice. There's a big one. Look. Is that too big? No. Love that. That's exactly it. Right. So. Um. That little ink bottle would have been nice on that black thing I've just made. That, that is probably shining at you, that um, glassine bag. I do apologise. Yeah, and then a label there. Lovely. Definitely having that. Oops, there we go. Ooh. We're having lots of rain still in the UK. We had um, a day off yesterday. It wasn't too bad. We had rain, <laughs> of course we did. We've had rain for weeks, but it wasn't heavy like it has been. They did say it was going to be a sunny day. It wasn't sunny here, um, but the rain was light, you know, like very light. But we're back. We're back with full-on rain today. Love that. Um, yes, yeah, so a label up there. So do I want one with something on it, or do I just want a plain? I suppose a plain one, so it could be you know, labelled, written on, a right on label. So, I decided not that, didn't I? Yeah, I don't think I want black. I wonder what I did with all the labels. Oh, I don't like that. It's got a nice outline on it. Petty cash, no. <laughs> it's got some lovely things, some lovely uh, words in it. 
Right, which do we like? No, I quite like that one actually. When I when I took it away, I missed it. That's always a a sign that it's maybe the right thing. Okay, what it really needs now is a a tag. I don't think I've got one, so let's just see if that, something like that's too small yet. Yeah. Okay, I've got some card, tag shaped, a bit too big. Let's trim it then. That's easy done. Oh, I like that clock. It's the thing about having them laid out on your desk is you, you spot things. That you wouldn't when you're digging through I, well i do like what we're going for seven and a half then i think centimeters yep that fits in nicely i suppose it could have been bigger my wanted bigger <laughs> i've got plenty of them don't worry let's go for eight and see what eight does yep eight's better put that back rid of those oh my bin's on its side that's not good, is it? So, do I want it lower than that? I think I do. Let's get a pencil. Yeah, I think I'd like that bit showing above. So, oh, it's not going to show much. Let's cut it and see. Yeah, it's very, very dark out now. So, I am getting shadows. Even for me to see, never mind you. <laughs> what I'm doing um, yeah ideally I don't like filming this late but sometimes you have to don't you yeah that just fits perfectly now it could have um probably will have a tab on on the top of it so and I'm thinking you know as soon as I'm speed crafting let's just cover the whole thing with a piece of this Obviously, I have to remember it's going to go behind that, so I might want something plainish. They're not big enough anyway. I quite like that. It's it's on card actually, but let me get a straight edge on it. A bit more chopping. <laughs> I think that that newspaper print might be nice behind the uh, the, the typewriter. That's what I was trying to say. I'm making it that sized and it's honestly I don't know why I don't just stick that on let's let's just do it a bit bigger and I'll stick it on and trim it down that that'll save me any uh... can I see the line now yep there I nearly used the wrong line then Anyway, well after the Y anyway. And the other one is where was that one? Can't see it. Why did I draw a line? Oh yeah, I see it now. <laughs> Somewhere around there. use some fabric tack because it will allow me to move it about a little bit which side do I prefer oops we're a bit dried up on the end let's just get rid of that just get me rubbish bag the right way up that's it like two holes in the lid of this and I didn't cut them they were already done <laughs> so I don't know if there's a reason for that bizarre but it's very strange <laughs> oh okay I hope I'm hope I've been in camera for you we might as well go to two edges hadn't we if they're straight I think they are yep yeah means we've only got two to cut then 
Right, it'll just take a few minutes to grab that, so I think what I'll do is leave it a few minutes rather than mess with it wet. And let's have a go at one of these. I'm thinking because it goes that way, I'll be able to use one of these lovely strips. Oh. Hmm, I quite like the math. That's a nice one. Um, math or maths, depending on which country you're in. <laughs> Bit of the strip. Yep, no lid on my glue look. It will very, very soon be trick or treating around here. We are starting to hear the odd fireworks, which um, we have a lot of fireworks on our bonfire night, which is five days, four days, <laughs> four days after trick or treating, four days after Halloween. Right, I've got a lid off everything. Come on, where's the lid off this? important one completely lost it i'll stick a pin in it because it's it's on my desk somewhere but i can't see it i know i'll be taking the lid off again in a minute it does bung up right don't use that don't use that what do we want on here not another tie right although that would be nice the brown sulky Champion in a hundred field trials. I'm guessing that's a horse then, is it? Matches. Where's that check? I love that check. Hmm, might be nice inside it. Let's fold the, what is the stub bit, yeah. And ink it. I'm going to put that inside this as the, the hidden journaling bit. One of my favourite pieces, I love a check. <laughs> I'm discovering an old vintage check. Well, that hasn't decorated it, has it? But it has <laughs> it's added something in it. Right, I still don't know what I want on the front. I did like that. I should have maybe made a, uh, um, yeah, or the clock. Oh yes, definitely like the clock. So I think I'd like a, a label under the clock. Cluster is what I was trying to say. Should have made a cluster up. But I think we're I think we're cooking with gas now. Friends pass. Yeah, I'm thinking something like this behind the clock. Yeah, that's nice. That's what I was thinking. Yeah, so easy when you've got all these bits. And I know um, I've been asked a few times where I get all my bits from. Well, when you've got a kit like this and either you get an add-on or you just print the, uh, the, em the embellishments off in various sizes and on various types of paper, then you can, you can easily end up with... Where was that going there, I think? You know, a pile of little bits like this that all go down, up. I wanted you down a bit, never mind. I've got a gluey mark there as well I need to cover. Yeah, this glue's not happy. Come on. We've not got much more to do. Crikey, where's the time gone? I thought I was about 15 minutes in. And I'm 20 odd. Can you still go up there? You might. Go and try. Yeah, I can. I just wanted it higher up. I'm thinking that will be nice with some um, gold around it, um, gold, you know, like wax. Okay, what we're doing here, we're trimming with the scissors, aren't I brave? And then I'll ink it, there is a little bit of white showing, but there won't be in a minute. So I hope you're all well, what you're all up to, let me know. Now I have to say, um, I said I, I would get to the uh, the comments and I haven't. So I still haven't said, I, I think I've done half of them, but there's still a lot left. So if you've commented 
um, I do see them come up and I've seen a lot of happy birthday ones so thank you so much um, I will get to reply them to them I just time has gotten away from me again just for a change so what do we want on here Can you hear the cogs whirring? I do like that. I know it's big, but I like it. The thing is, it's going to be on the show through here, isn't it? So anything, I like the look of the newspaper through it. So anything I put on it is going to hide. I don't really want anything on there other than a, a tab. Let's go for a, a plain tab. I'm thinking there. One of those. Maybe the clock on the back or something on the back. I know the back's for journaling, <laughs> but it's got to have something on it. This will tie in with the the paper, the colour of the card on the back as well. So, well, I didn't even try it, did I? <laughs> Come on. You're not giving me enough. You're going to be dry before I even get you on. Where's the pin that I keep putting in it? Oh, throwing the pin now. <laughs> oh, dear. Come on. Ah. Oh, say 30 seconds and then nothing. Right, that's not going to work. Be dry before I close it together. Oh, dear. I'm having glue gate today. I haven't had one of those for a while. Right, I know it's covering that name up, which is a shame. I could always decide oh, I'm to put something on there. Oh, hello. Some lace wants to come and play. <laughs> um, but for now, I won't. I'm thinking my little ink bottle. Look, I love this little ink bottle. And then maybe a label at the top. And that will be enough. That's a big nozzle after the uh, little art glitter one. Um, little, oops, yeah, sticking to me. That's because I'm using fabric tap. Little tiny label at the top is what I want. Well, not too tiny, but smallish. Blank is what I'm after. Blank one. No. Office closed. This one will be soon. Yep, you're blank enough. Don't want it over there, do I? So I'll probably go exactly under it. I won't go too close to the edge with this because it, it smooches out and leaves a snail trail. Yep, just on there a little bit. Look. Cloth. <laughs> I need an assistant today. Yep, I'll let it dry, but I think I might cut the, the corners off and give it a good ink round. And then, um, yeah, maybe put something on there. I don't know what yet, but there's lots of things that can go on it. There, I'll put it in there. Yep, I'm going to use that three. See if I can get one more done one. Let's do the, the envelope from the kit. This one goes that way as well, right. Let's use some of the things. Is that a lamp? Um, the problem with this is that white. I'm not going to cut it out because it will leave nothing of the handle left. But that's perfect, Denise. And I think I'll do the same with the... The necktie, although that is on cream paper, but yeah, that's better. Definitely better. Right, so which one do I want? Let's have the... It could be a weight, couldn't it? Holding some papers down. Or a ticket, so we'll go with that one. I definitely want that across there. Oh, look. So let's have that over there. Lying view. This weight. Right, what's the weight going to be on? 
um, where was that piece of paper that had the, the lines and the typewriter on it? Goodness me, I'm never going to find that now on my little teeny tiny one it was. That would have been good under there. No, you're not. No. Oh, there's another one of them. Another sort of check that could be holding that down. Yes, that's the thing. Exactly. So easy. Let's ink everything up, man. I'm thinking it could even have a, a label behind it because it looks like it should have an address. Yeah. Yes. Okay. <laughs> so... I wish I wasn't using this glue, I wish I was using my art glitter, but... Oh. Needs must. What do they say? Needs must when... No, it won't come to me. They're saying... What's the rest of it? You're good at telling me these things, come on. Needs must when something calls. I think it is. <sighs> necessity is it needs must wear necessity calls or am i just making that up <laughs> i've probably mixed two <laughs> two uh sayings up together quite lightly <laughs> that would be funny let me know if you know what the heck i'm talking about and you're holding that down yeah lovely i like that I get, even I'm amazed at how quick they've come together and I do often do stuff like this quickly but I wasn't expecting it to to be so easy shall we say yeah that's yeah up there a little bit because it's holding it down when the office window's open <laughs> whoops yeah I've got quite the blob on the end of my glue there now uh, I'll have you straight, I think. Yeah. Love that. Love the envelope. Love all the bits on it. Um, and it's an envelope, so I don't have to decide what's going in it now. Probably some of this paper here. Okay, so that will have to be it because... Oh, time. Time and tide. Wait for no man. <laughs> there we go. Right. Let's have a bit of space to see what we've done. Really love that one. I like them all to be honest. They're such fun. These kits are just such fun to play with. That's gorgeous, isn't it? On that black uh, envelope. A bit more room, please. So I've got that lovely packet. Um, packet pocket <laughs> and a tag, and then this lovely one. Okay, thoroughly enjoyed that. I hope uh, hope you had a little fix. I will see you. So today will be. Thursday for you. I will see you Friday with something I can't remember what. I'll see you Friday. Have a lovely day. Bye for now.